ICE, the Immigration and Customs Enforcement Agency, has made clear that this week it will, on orders from the Trump administration, round up possibly thousands of undocumented migrants starting this weekend. However, a new development may stand in the way. 27 pages of paper could block ICE from carrying out the raids. It said it's planned in 10 major metropolitan areas, including our own, the largest in the country, of course. So it is here that this lawsuit is now in a judge's hands. We just chose to file it in New York, where there are you know, tens of thousands of immigrants, and who knows how many of them, and how many more tens or hundreds of thousands of families uh, will be impacted. The suit is specifically against ICE as well as the U.S. Attorney General. And it seeks to stop deportations by arguing that undocumented people cannot be rounded up and shipped off without one key legally guaranteed action. This lawsuit seeks to ensure that anybody who is rounded up by ICE for deportation gets their day in court. But that doesn't necessarily mean that men, women, and children can't be rounded up. It does mean they can't be deported without a court hearing. That may prevent ICE from arresting people in the first place. They're fleeing societies where you don't get your day in court. America is a place where everybody gets their day in court, and that's what the lawsuit's about. And that lawsuit filed here at federal court just this afternoon, still awaiting a judge's decision, which could end up delaying this whole process altogether.